Hey guys, Mesa here. So today we're going to talk about faction transport ganking. So um, basically, uh, uh, people would take up these faction transport missions where they transport hearts across the royal continent, uh, trading for more hearts to make a profit. And our our goal is to gank these transports. So when you see a player with this icon on them, they're actually doing the mission. So it's like a, a icon above with the box. Um, it depends on their cargo size. It could be one box, two box, or three boxes. And uh, once you see these people, you can gank them, knock them down, and then get their hearts. So they will drop hearts. Um, a heart sells for like 40k right now, um, more than that. And uh, a lot of people actually don't notice this, but you get a lot of faction defense points by killing these transports. So you get at least 3,000 faction defense points by killing one of these transporters. And, uh, you know, 3,000 faction points can buy you one more heart, which is 40k more. So uh, unlike normal faction war, where if you kill someone, you only get silver on the ground in, you know, yellow zones, um, now you get a drop as well in yellow zones. As you can see, uh, I got like over 900k faction points just by doing faction ganking for like a week or two. So that's pretty good. Um, so you pick those up and then just sell them. Uh, a lot of the time these gankings really depends on the mount that you're on. So you yourself have to be on a fast mount. And then depending on the, you know, transporters uh, mount, you might want to either prioritize them or just give up. Um, because a lot of mounts like the bears, um, the bear type, the grizzly bears, the winter bears, they're just too tanky. So some people like to use uh, spectral dire boars, actually a lot of them like to use because they can go invisible for a few seconds to avoid ganks. Um, so these are hard to gank, but it's not impossible. Um, other than that, everything else like ox and, and you know, normal dire boars are just easy money. Um, for gears, um, you want as much CC as possible. Uh, my choice is mace with royal helmets, graveguard armor, hunter shoes, Lyran cane, you know, poison, demon cape. Those are all the stuff you can choose. Basically, your ganking gears. Um, if you're doing solo ganking, you might want to have as high tier as possible, um, just so your damage is there. Um, if not, if you're ganking in a group, then you can, you know, kind of go for 6.2, 6.3, or anything that you have. Another thing is that um, the ganking spot. So there are all these YouTube videos teaching people how to do faction transports. You can just watch those and then just gank them on the way, or just, you know, position yourself near the entrance or exits of every cluster or every map so that you know. Uh, when someone comes in or someone leaves this cluster with a transport. Um, it's always important to remember that it's not a stationary ganking um, as most gankings are. Uh, for faction ganking, a lot of times you have to remount and chase them down. Um, either you've already done some damage to their mount or you've already dismounted them and they have a blood letter and they're running around. You always have to look for the opportunity to remount usually especially if you're solo ganking you would have to remount and chase down um, the transporter just to dismount them or to you know kill them um, so if you're in a group then it's much easier um, and these are all in yellow zones so they're completely risk-free um, sometimes they might have friends that dismount and help them. Um, this isn't much of a problem if you're doing it in a group, but if you're solo, then you just have to kill the transport as quickly as possible. As long as you pick up the hearts, then everything is fine. Even if they kill you, it's fine. Um, so faction ganking is not the most time efficient thing on the world um, to make money. But it is good if you have something uh, on the side, like if you're watching a movie, doing something, doing some work. That's about it. Remember to like, comment, and share. Comment below any questions, whether you like this video or not, or you don't care. Uh, and happy hunting.